at the end of this lesson teachers will be able to define homophones and to distinguish between the meanings and spellings of common homophones they will teach their students what a homophone is and help them identify homophones Sometimes sets of words sound the same but they don't have the same meaning or the same spelling. For example, red and red. These words are called homophones. There are many more examples that we already know. For example, no and no right and right new and new die and die break and break past and past when we see these words written it is very easy to tell which meaning is being used because the spellings usually make it clear however when we hear them we can't see the spellings when we hear homophones we can usually guess the meaning without even thinking about it this is because usually only one word can make sense in the context listen to the following example samreen told me about your trip to the jungle i heard that you saw a herd of elephants herd is a homophone we could mean heard as in the past tense of hear or heard as in a group of animals let's try to figure out which meaning of heard is being used in which part of the sentence 